Good news, everybody. Doing more shiz. Uh, this just came from By Design, and this has stuff for this car. What kind of stuff, you ask? Some seriously cool stuff in here. Some seriously dangerous stuff in here. Some seriously insane stuff in here. Probably should not do the stuff that's in here, but I'm not great at making good decisions, so. For today's opening, we'll be using the Protec TR3. This one has carbon fiber inlaid into the handle. 154 cm steel blade. Feels really good, by the way. I would definitely recommend one. What's in here? So much good stuff. Are you so excited? I got you inlet hoses. But that's not the fun part. I'll get the stuff all pulled out and uh, we'll take a look at it. We've got some of the DO88 Turbo inlet hoses. This is our methanol um, injection kit and that's gonna be a lot of fun. And then the best part, these are upgraded larger turbos. I almost forgot these. Um, these are cat bypass pipes. And with this kind of setup, I really can't run the catalytic converters and go all out because this is gonna be a race car. We're gonna put these uh, bypass pipes on for the race tune when we do our event. So one of the things we fight up here in Utah is the higher elevation. And so bigger turbos and a methanol kit, which will simulate a higher octane fuel is gonna be really important to give us some of that top end power that we're just missing. Why does top end speed matter? Because I have an event coming up and it's a top speed event. Uh, I'll post the, the info below. If you want to come check it out, please feel free. I don't know what this is going to do for us necessarily, uh, but I know we're going to have fun. Oh, that's good stuff. Got in, cut it to fit. Okay, that's a good idea. All kinds of good stuff happening. Look at that. Oh my gosh. They even kind of put plastic on my seat. Bad, bad things are happening. There's some narration here. There's no narration. It no comes narration. later. No, we That's just, we true. just, we cut this out. I checked out your YouTube video. Did you That's see? Not true. Oh my gosh. There's narration. Hope you subscribe. Yeah. Once I have uh, 300 more, I can monetize my videos. <laughs> yeah. And that's like 10 bucks a month. So yeah. you shouldn't laugh. Get it on my finger so I can taste it. Okay. Mm. Yeah, we're making a mess with all this gold juice. Alright, I'm actually going in the car. You got this. Had a couple good test runs at this point. Nothing's blown up, nothing's come loose. The shop did great work, uh, they always do. And um, yeah, I'm just really, uh, really pleased so far. The butt dino says that it's awesome. It's seriously like running race fuel. Not a huge, not a huge uh, increase on the bottom end, but the top end fills in so nicely. This thing used to start lagging around 80 miles an hour, and now it just hauls and hauls. This is such a cool gauge, in my opinion. It does everything that it needs to do. It shows you your boost pressure and your methanol injection level. The setup on this is super easy. You just pick when the methanol injection comes on, and then it ramps up to uh, full injection based on your PSI. Power nozzle on or off, text color, graph color, whether the injection is on or off, and that's it. I mean, that's, that's it.
man, this thing just hauls. It is amazing. That's just on 91 pumped with the methanol tune. Oh, it's fantastic. There is a lot of testing left to do, so I will get to that in the coming weeks and we will see exactly what this stage four Turbo S can do. Until next time, I am obeying all the traffic laws here in Mexico.